without further ado, let me introduce to you the next head coach for women's basketball, Tom Garrett. It goes by quickly, and we knew that going in. These games are coming twice a week, and they're unrelenting, but we feel like we're in a pretty good position. I said this when I took the job, that we're not taking this year off. This is not a gap year. This is not a, hey, this is our first year, we're gonna see what happens. No, we think we can win right now. We have that kind of confidence and we're trying to instill that kind of confidence in our players. And I tried to have zero expectations. I wanted it to be balanced. I didn't want to get too high or too low. I didn't want to sell the kids short and I didn't want to sell them a pie in the sky. I wanted us to be solid. And I think we're finding our footing. As a competitor, I always want more, and I want our kids to want more also. I want our players to want more. So I think we're, we're hitting the note pretty close to where I thought we would be. We had a really competitive and tough non-conference schedule, and it's prepared us pretty aptly for uh, the America East Conference schedule. So I feel pretty good about where we are. I think we could have one or two more wins. But that's a good thought. That's a good thing. I, I, we're not down in the dumps about that. We're coming to practice being competitive every day and looking for more every day. That keeps us motivated knowing that we could be better right now. The America East is a really tough conference, but I think we're right in the middle of the pack. So we could fall anywhere, so that keeps us fresh and hungry. I'd like to think that I'm prepared for whatever this team could throw at me, a life can throw at me, but Bree Rudolph amazes me every day, just her intensity, she comes to fight every day, and she's our team leader, and I can't give her enough credit for where we are right now. Giving an honest effort every day. When you come to work, or when you go to your job, or you go to class, or you come to practice, give your best. Try to get better that day, that drill, that given moment. And if you can do that, that to me, that's playing with integrity. And if we can play with integrity, compete with integrity, prepare with integrity, that's where you get a chance and an opportunity to be competitive in each and every given day. It's a build-up process and it's a step-by-step -step process that we're trying to get our kids to buy into. I'm looking forward to making people think that UMass Lowell is further ahead than they thought we would be. I don't know if that's gonna be instilled fear or just respect, but I want our kids to get the respect that they deserve and we're gonna do that by making people respect us. That's what I'm looking forward to.